Christian Ronaldo warned the world that the Saudi Pro League would be a top 5 league in the recent future. I believe that right now, it isn't. But in terms of viewership, if Mbappé happens, this is a game-changing move. But before I get to it, don't forget to like, comment, comment your thoughts about this move that is supposedly might happen of Mbappé to Ali Lal, and don't forget to share this video to other people. First things first, I want to say to everyone, I really want Mbappé to go to Real Madrid as fast as possible. I really do. But Mbappé, if he doesn't go to Real Madrid this summer, the Premier League would be the destination because they hold the funds to pay a player like Mbappé if he were to stay in Europe, the Premier League. But Ali Lal, Ali Lal has stepped in and said, if you have to pay big, the Saudi Pro League what Ali Lal pays big too. And they're not playing. They're buying players, Ali Lal, that can play right now at a high level. Rubenev, Sergei Milinkovic Savic, Kolibali, they want Mitrovic. Imagine Mbappé too in all this for one year, knowing he goes to Real Madrid. That is bold. And I want to say Ali Lal, coached by George Zuz. Eu vou ver o Jorge, eu, I'm gonna see Jorge Zuc coaching Mbappé? That is insane. The biggest losers in all this, and from my point of view, it's the Premier League and the Champions League. It's, it's, it's a fact now that the Saudi Pro League and leagues outside of Europe, like the MLS2, are growing are growing with these signings. Messi is literally gonna be paid by Apple, gonna be paid by Adidas, plus the league 150 million in, 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 in the range of like two years. That is mad money. And the Saudi Pro League is saying, we're not playing. We want worldwide exposure. The Saudi family clearly wants to be the most talked topic in the world right now. And getting Mbappé for 700 million as a salary, 300 million paid to PSG. Mbappé with this Ali Lal contract is going to become a billionaire. 700 million one year, 58 million a month, 13 million a week, and 1.9 million a day. That is insane! Like, a footballer getting this, it's more than football now. This is a worldwide topic, and look, who would say no to this? Mbappé can't say no! Once again, I really, I really, I would love if Mbappé stayed in Europe playing Champions League football, but who would say no to 700 million offered for one year? If, look, the best scenario, accepting this deal of Ali Lal, the best scenario for Mbappé is to say, look guys, I'm gonna accept one year from Ali Lal, but in 2024, I have an agreement with Real Madrid, and that's why I left PSG. So one year at Ali Lal, 700 million, and then Real Madrid. La Liga wins with that because the Premier League would have gotten Mbappé. So if in my point of view, with these 300 million paid to PSG, PSG definitely wins. The most expensive sale in football history. Real Madrid wins because he goes to Real Madrid for a cheaper fee than going right now. And Mbappé wins becoming a billionaire. But in terms of football, he could win a Ballon d'Or any season. Mbappé at Real Madrid. So we have to wait for a year, like, in order for him to go. It's, I don't want to see, and I think it's stupid. And that's why PSG won't let it happen. PSG will not let Mbappé sit out a seat. It's just stupid for them to let it happen. And if they can get the most expensive sale in the history of football, shouldn't they do it? Shouldn't they do it, people? But leave your comments about what I'm saying down below. I really want to see a debate down below. What do you think? The Saudi Pro League with Mbappé is a top five viewed league in the world. And people will be picking Saudi Pro Leagues to support. Al Nasser, Al Ittihad, Al Alil, Al Hilal with Mbappé now. If it happens, people will be backing one of them and watching. So it's, it's the consequence of the world we live in right now. Oh my days. But do you still feel he's going to reject this offer? It can happen. It can happen. But I want to see the numbers of the offer that he accepts. Because <laughs> I don't know. Al Ittihad has Benzema, Jota, Kante, Kante bought a club in the third division in Belgium with his money that he signed with Al Ittihad. The players are changing their lives in, 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 in Saudi Pro League, monetarily. So again, this is a consequence of the world we live in, and players will start accepting that if they want to change the life, their lives monetarily, and the lives of their grandchildren, who would say no? Ruben Neves is earning 25 million a season. Christian Ronald, 200 million a season. Bezema, 200 million a season. These are bold numbers. Even Jota, Jota, a 24 year old, leaves Celtic to go to Al Ittihad. He, 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 he must believe in the league, and obviously the, the contract 
has a huge effect too. So the Saudi Pro League next season could have like Mbappé if he accepts Dalilal, Christian Ronald, Benzema, a front trio in a team with Mahrez, Firmino, San Maxim. That's levels! Levels! Everybody's gonna be starting to at least pay attention to the results. And who wins the league? The top four race! Allah said with Christian Ronald, Brozovic, coach Luis Castro, Seku Fofana that was the team of the year, the team of the season, sorry, of League A. Levels, he's a baller, people. And Alex Sells has just signed, like those crosses to Ronald. It's interesting to watch. So on that side, well position. Ali Tiad, well position. Ali Lal, the best team in my in my opinion. They're preparing for something. Do you know what it is? Do you know what it is? Put it in the comment section if you know what I'm gonna say next. <laughs> MLS, Saudi Pro League. They're all preparing for the FIFA Club World Cup that's gonna change and be with three, 32 teams in 2025. A whole, total restructure because right now, who watches the FIFA Club World Cup? There's not a lot of people, and they have to change that. And with this restructuring, with 32 teams, in order to play in the FIFA World Cup, you gotta win a Champions League, you gotta win a Copa Libertadores, you gotta win an AFC Champions League, because Ali Lal are the winners of the AFC Champions League, and with an Mbappé. Hi, everybody's gonna be watching. I hope he will not be there by the time it's 2025, and he's at Real Madrid if this Ali Lal deal happens. But still, it's a growing, they're growing and developing the Saudi Pro league with this move leave a like if you think that he should go to Real Madrid just like me I believe he should go to Real Madrid but look 700 million it's it is what it is he's going to be an ambassador for the Saudi Saudi Arabia and the Saudi Pro League Mbappé with this team this is life changing the captain of the French national team that's a top three a hundred percent player in the world is going to the Saudi Pro League this changes the whole global landscape of the league. Like, the world has changed. If you're watching until now, do not forget to like this video. It's a huge help for the FC Wonder Kid channel. Watch other videos of other topics like Messi we've just released and comment down below your thoughts. We wanna know what you're thinking about the Mbappé deal, the Saudi Pro League. This is life changing right now. The world is changing. And share with other people our videos of FC Wonder Kid. Thank you community for watching until now.